Hello, this is Claire XX22, and I'm going to do a book review on all the Twilight books. First of all, I'm going to start with Twilight, the very first book in the series. And what do I think of this book? I really enjoy this book. The first time I read it, I read it like three times. And it's a book which, this book makes me want to read it loads and loads of times because it's so gripping. And I love the storyline. And this is this book, which is when Bella first meets Edward. And I really, the author, I really like the author, Stephanie Mayer. I like, I like how she wrote the book. And she's written, she's done, I like, I like all the characters in the book. It's very, it's a very good book, and it's really gripping, and it makes you want to read it, read it, like, <coughs> it makes you want to read it over and over again. And um, what would I rate this book out of 10? I would rate this book a uh, 10 out of 10. Now I'm going to go on to New Moon, which is the second book in the series. New Moon is the book where... Edward decides he needs to leave Bella because he wants Bella. He wants to protect Bella and he wants to make sure Bella be alright without him. And <clears throat> he leaves Bella. And Bella, um. Bella is so upset because she's about Edward and she goes into a bit of a big depression and she turns to her friend um, Jacob Black. And most of the story, she's doing stuff with Jacob and she's mending a bike and stuff. And then she goes cliff diving and Edward, Edward thinks she's dead. And then in the end she goes away with Alice. And she goes over with Alice, and she goes and saves Edward. Because Ed Edward is going to kill himself because he thinks he thinks Bella's dead. And um, this book is really good. Like I said with the first one, this one is really gripping as well. It makes you want to read and read to the end because you want to find out what happens. You don't want to stop reading it because it's that good. This book, I rate it a uh, 10 out of 10 as well. I'm going on to the next book. This book is Eclipse, which is the third book in the series. This book is where... Where, where um, they find out, find out there's some newborn vampires going around and they're killing people. And... Um, find out who's involved with it and did see and um the vampire one of the vampires is after Bella and that's um one of the evil ones is after her and Edward is trying to protect her um, the vampire that was after Bella is Victoria, and um, they decide to the um, Edward and his family decide to um, fight against these vampires, and they kill them all off. And Edward um, Edward finally kills off Victoria. This book is also really gripping, and um, in the end, at the end of this book, Edward asks Bella to marry him, and she says yes. And also in this book, she also has a lot of feelings for Jacob as well. But in the end, she chooses Edward, which really pleased me. <laughs> um, I rate this. I rate this book ten out of ten, also because. I love this. This probably this book, Eclipse, is probably my favourite book in the series. And I'm now going on to the very last book, which is a really big one, which is in Breaking Dawn, and it's got the chess piece on the front. 
and the chess piece showing how Bella has um, succeeded from the last first book. She's a tiny little pawn, and then she in the last book she is come up to a queen. So it shows you what she's how she succeeded. Um, this book is the last book in the series. It's where Bella and Edward get married and they go on their honeymoon <clears throat> and they have a everything goes wrong. It turns out she is pregnant and she's going to have a baby. So they have to rush back to Phoenix. Not Phoenix, it's Forks, isn't it? Forks. They go back to Forks and she ends up staying in bed a lot and um, she's really poorly for half of the book and in the end they think she's dead and then she does have the baby before they think she's dead and then then Edward has to inject his he has to um, turn into a vampire and then in the end she comes back alive as a vampire and then the um, evil vampires, I think, the um, Voltori find out that Bella's daughter, Rosaline, their um, daughter, Resmine, is um, half human and um, they fight against it. And then in the end, they, the Voltori come in. The whole tour, you're all right with it in the end. And this book is really good. It's quite gripping. It um, it's quite a long book because it's um quite a big one. I'll tell you how many pages it is. It takes time for you to read it. It's um, six hundred and ninety-nine pages long. I rate this book, this Twilight book, um, a 10 out of 10 as well. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video, YouTubers. If you can add a comment at the bottom of this video, that would be great. Thank you. Bye.